Oh, and right, you guys. This guy never skips disappointing your parents' day. Last Halloween, he dressed as himself and scared the kids. But this Halloween, he wants to be an officer. His head says security, but his body says insecurity. His first act as a police officer should be sorting out that crime on his arms. <laughs> If you doubled his IQ and gave it to the next person, it would still be zero. Professional bodybuilder, yes, yes. He's trying to convince people that he's a professional bodybuilder, but he's not even half the man his mother was. Wow, 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 wow. Anyway, let's forget this victim of the oil industry and have a look at another one. His shirt says Adidas, because he's like all day I dream about Synthel. You can call his arms Mount Everoil. If his bicep peaks were any bigger, he would have snow on them. <laughs> <laughs> no matter what you're going to do in life, your body can do it. It's time to convince your mind. This guy over here is naturally strong. He got the strength, the power and the right mindset. The only thing that he's missing is better cable management for the veins on his arms. When he hit the machine, it stopped working, because the machine can detect fake muscles and fake strength. This guy from Poiland is 50% oil and 50% disappointment. But at least they can laugh about it and spread the joy. This woman is the reason why pizza places deliver. And she's also the reason why they don't deliver to her area anymore. But anyway, let's put the bad jokes aside for a second and appreciate her natural legs. If you look at her legs, you can tell the time. It's Tren o'clock. She's a fake natural and she always skips truth day. Lying about being natural has become natural. She is on more juice than Tropicana. This woman got something like butt implants or butt pads. No matter what it is, it looks like a pain in the ass. She is not training her OnlyFans muscle, she is training to use public bathrooms. Let's stop judging her before someone gets butt hurt. Liver King doesn't go to the grocery store often, but if I do, I'm coming in with one trip. This is Liver King, aka the guy who always skips Truth Day. He makes one trip when he carries the groceries, but he makes several trips when he goes to the pharmacy. I'm gonna put a little bit of dill, a little bit of salt, and a little bit of Tabasco, which I'm told is really good. Liver King, of course, likes it right out of the sack. I I don't even want to touch that. So let's see how it tastes. Looks like he skipped mental health day for a while now. I wonder what would happen if I start doing this. If I could start getting girls. How you doing, ladies? Never skip face day. He's the type of guy whose parents don't expect anything from him, but he still disappoints them. But at least he was wearing a face protection. This guy over here never skips knee day. There is more tension on his knees than on a paternity court. And the DNA results are that you are not the father. Tell Tell life, I tell you. Anyway, you guys, always remember, at the end of the day, it's night. And every little thing is gonna be all right. If it's not all right, it's not the end.